about a year ago, I published a podcast on Cosmic Ray's increasing hail size and duration. And we showed some amazing footage here of hailstorms that are burying cars in Mexico City. Now, I'm going to walk you through what has happened so far this spring season in the U.S. April 23rd, hail is a common sight during severe weather outbreaks, but the formation of hail as large as an egg takes particularly long, large cells. And a southern storm dropped egg-sized hail back on April 23rd over Texas. A short while later, in Loco, Texas, and this is May 7th of 2020, three-inch hail was reported with Thursday night storm. And then a short while later, here on May 21st, San Angelo, Texas, reporting four-inch hail. Do you see a pattern? And this comes in through my email today. This hailstone was picked up yesterday by an eight-year-old in Texas. That's true. Eight-year-old finds larger hail larger than a softball in Burke, Burnett, Texas. An eight-year-old, Will Moody, says he found it in a field. And they're investigating his claim. And now take a look at the size of some of the hail that fell just a little further northwest in Burke Burnett. This is just north of Wichita Falls. Eight-year-old Will Moody found it in a field at a friend's house. His dad, Cody, couldn't believe the size of it. It was pretty wild. Um, you know, I've lived here for the majority of my life and uh, seen a bunch, bunch of crazy storms, but I've never seen one quite uh, uh, so full of hail like that. It just kind of kept coming and kept coming and kept coming with multiple rounds of hail, actually. Moody says the National Weather Service measured it. The circumference is 14.5 inches, which is about two inches larger than a softball. Okay, so there you heard it directly from the source. And if we quick look over the circumference at 14.5, we'd place it at average diameter around 4.6154 inches. So we can see the hail is increasing from March uh, through April, egg size. Beginning of May, 3-inch, late May, 4-inch, end of May, 4.6-inch hail. And if you remember what the father said, he has been there his whole life, and he never saw the duration also of hail as long as this storm. Because as we warned a year ago, increased hail size and duration because of cosmic rays is in the cards. And we have empirically showed this to you year after year. Increase in size, increase in duration, right before your very lives. Now, this is not new information. A paper coming out June 2015, prediction of lightning inception by large ice particles and extensive air showers, suggests that increased lightning is due to large ice in the upper atmosphere. In fact, if elongated ice particles of six centimeters of length or more occur up in the upper atmosphere, well, then you can get huge lightning bolts. So these are sign of the times. These large hailstones that are getting ever larger because of cosmic rays and the grand solar minimum are going to create huge lightning bolts as well. And we've seen over the last three years massive amounts of lightning deaths worldwide especially in the Middle East. So, sign of the times. I'll leave you links to this podcast from a year ago so that you can compare and contrast what has been going on. And if you get anything out of this, you should know that hail this size falling in your neighborhood, well, that's just not good news, period. Especially during a pandemic. I hope you got something out of the video. Share this with like-minded people. Buy a helmet and be safe. We love you. That's Boo. To knowledge.